Good morning. I'm Travis Guillory and I'm Corey Duke and here are your top stories from two works for you. A bald eagle is recovering at the Tulsa Zoo after game wardens say it was found shot in the wing near Miami. The eagle is expected to be OK, but wildlife officials say it's likely the bird will never fly again. It's expected to be fully rehabilitated in about two to three months, then sent to an animal rescue. A ribbon cutting ceremony is going to be happening this afternoon in Broken Arrow to celebrate the completion of a long awaited section of road. The new one mile stretch of North 37th Street, also known as 209th East Avenue, is going to connect 51st Street to 61st Street. City officials say this was the last major section line road in the city that was not continuous. And the next Democratic presidential debate takes place in South Carolina tonight. The two hour debate takes place ahead of Saturday's primary in the state and is the final debate before Super Tuesday. The same six candidates who took part in Wednesday's debate in Nevada will participate, including Mike Bloomberg. Now it's going to check out today's forecast from meteorologist Clint Boone. Thank you very much, Travis and Corey. Bundle up out there this morning. Temperatures are starting off in the 30s for us. There will be a storm system moving in by afternoon, so have the rain gear handy. Some spotty showers later on today, especially into the evening hours with temperatures in the upper 40s. Might see a light wintry mix tonight, ending early tomorrow morning, 42 for a high, and then a nice warm up by the end of the week and weekend. High temperatures this weekend, lower to upper 60s. All right, thanks, Clint, and thank you for tuning in to this digital news update. Keep checking back for more updates throughout the day. And be sure to join Karen Larson and Mike Brooks tonight at 5, 6, and 10 on Two Works for You.